Good morning, everyone. How you doing? So I thought I'd just pop in here just a couple minutes early with you. I know that we had made some last minute changes and everything like that. So I just wanted to kind of make sure, give everyone a chance to get here um, and, you know, just say hi, just a little bit early here before we start our monthly meditation, which is going to be about, it's about giving and receiving, but it's far more of the angle of receiving and what a difference um, that can make in your abilities to give. So yeah, just kind of give me a second to double check everything here and make sure that we're going. Uh, so normally I check in with Kiri. So I guess Kiri, if you're here, let me know if we've got everything going. Okay. Uh, looks like we do though. So yes. All right. And we're just about a minute before. So as you can tell, yes, I am outside today. And for the last few months, I've been doing these in front of my plum tree and it's been absolutely amazing to share that with you although today the reason i am not in front of the plum tree is because it's really extra cold down there and um, i couldn't find an extension cord long enough and i right for right now and i know that um, my battery gets hit pretty hard on my computer and i didn't want to die part way through so i'm up on my back porch and i'll just so the plum tree is down there but right now what we've got, this is my uh, my honeysuckle that in uh, some, sometimes when we've done this show too or done this meditation, I've been with my honeysuckle. So that's where I am today. And the reason I am outside is number one, you know, it's, it's nature. I love being with nature and you, you all know that anyway. And, um, it, it, to me, you really can meditate anywhere, and this is not just something that has to be done in an ideal location. Um, you can also really pull those elements of everything outside into your meditations as well. So be smart about it. As you can see, I'm pretty well bundled up. Today it is 20 degrees out, and which is what that's about negative six, negative seven, something like that. So it's pretty chilly. Um, so as I've always said, dress to the elements of where you are, because if you get too warm, you can take layers off, um, use shade in the summertime. But that's what I'm doing today, showing you. And I, I do, I have my winter sleeping bag on my legs and all kinds of stuff, but I'm nice and toasty here right now. Meditation can warm you up, and there have been times when I have done a meditation when I got so warm that I was just sitting in the snow and like bare skin and didn't even know that um, I was sitting on the snow. So anyway, that is a part of meditations as well. So work with it, see, see where you are. Um, Beyond that, we're gonna, I'm gonna start. I'm assuming I don't need to introduce myself, but I'm Colleen Fletcher. I've been doing this meditation, guiding you guys in this for, what are we looking at? 15, about 15 years, something like that. Uh, I don't know, a long time. It started with my beautiful friend, Joy. Sometimes she still pops in here every once in a while. I know she's a part of the group. So if you're here, hi, Joy, love you. Um, but, for this meditation, it is going to be giving and receiving. And uh, you know, this is the time when a lot of people actually do more with giving. My outlook on that is amazing. Thank you so much for all that you give, but remember to take care of yourself. And that's where the receiving comes into it as well. Uh, so, you know, think about, think about different ways that you can pull in for yourself. Okay, um, it is the balance of human nature, um, giving, receiving, it's the yin and the yang. It is the divine feminine, the divine masculine, it's the dark and the light. So whichever one of that resonates with you, then, then that's where 
that those are the verbiage that's the verbiage you need to use with it but definitely know that it's a balance and that's what we're talking about here it's a balance it's that homeostasis within you that's the goal with this okay so before we go any deeper into it we are going to start with our first meditation which is always the letting go of the outside world and coming into you coming into right here right now with you so i'm going to invite you to close your eyes taking that deep breath into your dantian which is your lower abdomen um, you know, if you need to measure it out, it's actually three fingers below your belly button. So measure that out if you need to, but expand that area. A couple more deep breaths in, fully relaxing, fully releasing that breath. your next inhalation take it down into your hips a little bit more stretch that area out move if you need to and then with your exhalation the moment you think that you have hit the end of your full exhalation just pause for a moment and then gently allow your next breath to come in And another breath in, feeling the connection travel down your legs, into your feet, and into the earth, just like you are a tree with your roots deeply connected. Now exhale. And on this exhalation, after that brief pause, just a little more of an exhale. Just push, just for a moment. Just a puff of air out. Continue deeply clearing your lungs. Now, Go ahead and slowly open your eyes, knowing that you are right here, right here with yourself, right here in this present moment, giving to yourself, receiving from me, receiving from others that join us with this, just receiving that love and that, that being, that being together, okay? <sighs> All right, so giving and receiving. We all know what uh, what giving is, or I hope we do. You know, that's the act of giving, giving a compliment, giving of our time, giving of, of a gift, anything like that. And we know pretty much how that makes us feel. You know, maybe that's something you can work on as well of how else that makes you feel. But, you know, we have a pretty good idea of that. Um, you know, and they can be anything. It can be like a smile as well. It's just something simple. Um, 
But what I'd like you to think about is when you do give something, expand a bit more on this. Um, how do you how do you respond when you give? Does it make you happy? Does it make you feel uncomfortable? Anything like that. So first identify that, work with that a little bit, but that's the easier part of what we're doing is that we, we do, we really know how that makes us feel. But what I'd like you to then work on, and this is going to be the main thing that we're focusing on, as I've said, is how do you respond to receiving? And we're just going to use the example of a compliment um, because that's the one that most people kind of notice is, um, you know, how you can react to receiving a compliment. Um, so think about it. The last time someone said something nice to you, how did you respond? Did you kind of go, mm, yeah, thanks? Because really what that does is that part takes away from what they have given you. That diminishes them. So don't you think it would be better to when you receive something as in the compliment of, yeah, thank you, and accept it as it is. It's a gift to you. So that's the, the main aspect with all of this is to really work with receiving well receiving well receiving the kindness and allowing that gift that someone has given you to fully permeate the wonderful being of you because i'm assuming that you know when people say something nice they're not doing it just to blow smoke up your ass i mean some people probably will but You'll, you'll know the difference with that, and, and you'll know. So, so just, just work with that, okay? That's the biggest thing. Um, the next thing to look at with it is for in you, or other places to look at with this for you, is how do you feel it and where do you feel it? Do you feel it in your body that it makes you uncomfortable? You know, do you shy back away from it um, it, it's really that matter of that knee-jerk response to it at first and then where it is in your body and um, we, we are going to go into some meditations with that as well uh, just to expand because that's what we're all about. Okay, so um, body language. We've covered that a little bit, noticing how it's going to shift in your body when you receive something. Um, and again, we're just sticking with the idea of a compliment. I guess if anyone has uh, questions now, I'll do my best to to answer those now. Um, if not, then I'll, I'll get back to those in the thread, and later on I'll answer those for you too. Um, but other things to really look at with this are uh, uh, eye contact as well. They're, they're all your own body languages. And I'm just generalized, generalizing right now with uh, different examples. You're going to know. But where most people tell me they notice these things are you know, eye contact in their head. Um, they they just kind of don't believe it. Uh, you know, they're like, they'll say thank you, but deep within them, they're like, all right, whatever. They're just saying that. Okay. And those are the subtle things, the subtle yet massive things that we are going to uh, work with. Okay. With the meditations. Um, so we know now that when we don't fully accept a gift, no matter what format it is, we are taking away from the intention that the person gave it to us in, okay? That in itself is really, really, really big, okay? So we're gonna get into another bit of a meditation. And what I want you to do with this is 
notice at least one place within your body that you hold it or one action that you do that shifts that that is not um, positive with it. Okay, so we're going to go into our next meditation now. And I want you to feel the uncomfortableness or just the, the funk, the funk that you feel, what, whatever it is for you. Okay, it's so very personal. So notice that. And I, I want with this meditation, I want you to be slightly uncomfortable because that's what we're going to shift. Okay. So be uncomfortable with me. Um, if you need to, you know, just write it down a little bit in your notes. Uh, if you have pen and paper with you, do that, but go into this and be a bit uncomfortable. Okay. So oh, move your body around. Take a couple deep breaths again, close your eyes and really find where, when you receive a compliment or a gift, how you feel internally. You might need to ask yourself the question of where am I feeling this? How do I respond? It's perfectly acceptable now to kind of have a conversation with yourself during this meditation. Okay, my tree lovers, come on back. 
opening your eyes. Okay, so do you have some, I, I did see the comments here, so I know that um, I'm gonna have to turn this off a bit. Okay. Um, I know many of you are saying that you just don't receive well. So hopefully this gives you a better idea of where it is and kind of what you're doing as well. This one, you know, you can keep working with this. Just ask, okay, where is it that I am not receiving well? Uh, how can I expand myself to receive more? So work with it. I still work with it. You know, there are still times that old habits come back to me and I think, yeah, all right, whatever, thanks. Well, that's not fair to you. I know you're being nice and kind and I do really, really appreciate it. So it's my issue with that. And, and that's just what I want you to keep getting out of this, that it's not that it's bad, but it's something to expand upon and for, your own personal growth to to do that and to receive well, okay? So uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can get some, a few more quick messages here um, as to comments. I'm gonna try and see if I can get Okay, not going to happen right now, which I totally, totally understand all of this. So we'll, we, we can, we'll keep working on it. If you have individual things, then post them here in the thread later, and I'll answer them here for you, okay? Um, but keep working with yourself. Keep being nice to yourself. This is the season of giving and receiving, so use it. Practice receiving well. Not only do I want to hear if you're still having issues with it, I want to see and hear how you worked with this, what you did to receive better. Okay? Um, accept a compliment with grace. Smile at the person and say, thank you. Smile. It's that simple, honestly. Um, Know that the more that you accept and receive, the more that you can give, okay? That's a really subtle part of it, yet extremely vast as well, okay? So the more you receive, the more you can give. The next time someone compliments you or gives to you, accept it well and their gift will be even that much more encompassing because you have received well it, it i call it an equal and fair energetic exchange so the kindness given expands when it is kindness received okay so we're going to go into our final meditation now. And as you can see, the sun is shining bright here. It's one of those cold, bright mornings. So I keep wiggling around so that I can uh, not be blinded by the light here. Um, but you keep focusing on yourself because that's the main part of it here, okay? Not me. Uh, but what I want you to do, this is the final meditation where I go in and, and I have some affirmations written for you and I'll get those posted in the thread here as well for you, okay? Um, so our final meditation, our next meditation will be with the affirmation. So hear those, receive those well this time, okay? Receive them in a different fashion. If it was an area that physically hurt on your body when you noticed before, then take these in to you. Bring them into this moment right here, right now with you 
to shift all of how you give so that you are so how you receive so it's not something still in the future it's something you are doing now actively okay so we're going to close our eyes another deep breath where your shoulders release your chest releases your low back releases your hips are opening and comfortable you're grounded like your favorite tree taking a couple deep breaths being with that beautiful self of you knowing that I receive lovingly you receive lovingly I allow myself to receive full gifts offered to my entire being. You allow yourself to receive the full gifts offered to your entire being. With thanks, comfort, and grace, you receive. With thanks, comfort, and grace, I receive. You receive lovingly. Go ahead and take another really deep breath and release your shoulders on your exhalation now. You allow yourself to receive the full gifts offered to your entire being. With thanks, comfort and grace you receive.
Knowing that these shifts have already taken place within you, within your physical mind, within your conscious and subconscious mind, these changes have now taken place. Take a moment to thank yourself for all of this work you've done. Know that the next time you receive anything, you will receive it well with loving grace. Taking another final breath for this meditation and fully releasing, slowly opening your eyes. This time coming back to your full awareness. So thank you. Thank you for being here. It's always wonderful, 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 wonderful having you here with me. So thanks. Um, next time you give a, give a compliment, notice. Notice how the other person receives it as well. That can help you uh, continue to expand upon how you receive as well. Knowing that the more that you receive, the more you can give, and that your capacity in both has massively expanded. I have total trust in your abilities. I know you guys can do this. And I know so many of you that are here, I, I see and talk with all the time. So I am really, really looking forward to that. If you're new here with us, then you know, say hi, let us know how everything's going for you as well, how your capacity to receive has just expanded. Um, so with that, my tree lovers, it's time for me to get back in the house and get a little bit warmer, uh, get a lot warmer actually, although I'm really warm, it's not a problem right now. I actually feel really good. Um, but thank you for our time together. Remember to join the Facebook group, um, you know, follow along on Instagram. There's photos put up all the time. There's reminders. Uh, you can post um, uh, in the Facebook group images of trees, that type of thing. And um, yeah, that's it. Um, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here with me. Um, I am going to put a link up in here for donation, as this is always set up with donation, and it's always much appreciated. Um, so there is that. And what else? I'm going to start doing these on Discord as well, I think. Um, so I know the link for Discord is there. So join that server. There's going to be a lot more inter um, engagement with many of the things that I do on that. And I think you'll find that one fun. Um, it's been a great platform for me to learn. It's just still kind of vast for me because it takes a bit. But I'll get it. I'm getting help with that. So I'm much appreciative of it. Uh, so thank you. Thank you so much, my tree lovers. Until uh, our next time together, where I'll probably still be outside again. Um, I think. I'm not sure. I don't know. It's always exciting figuring this out. But I'm going to sign off for now, okay? So much love, everyone. Bye.